Hi sweetlings, it's me again, Yuli, and welcome to my channel. And again, to those who are new to my channel, welcome, welcome, welcome. So right now, I'm gonna be reacting to one video of 123 Japan. This particular video keeps on popping up on the suggested video to watch. And this video is entitled, 5 Reasons Why Japanese Shouldn't Come to the Philippines. It's kind of very, you know, catchy. So let's see in what's this video all about. Not usual video because I'm so angry. <laughs> I went to the Philippines over six times. I got so many experience. But uh, after I go back to Japan, I feel like I should not go back to the Philippines anymore. Every time I go to the Philippines, I feel like so <laughs> many feelings. So today I'm gonna talk about five <laughs> reasons Japanese people you should not come to the Philippines. Let's go! Before I watch this video, please subscribe our channel and follow my Instagram. Manahalo! Done subscribing. Let's go! Done following you. Number Instagram. one, your personality will be changed because Japanese person is very, very shy. Me too. When we do something, we focus on it and we don't care about other people, right? We only focus on like school, job. <laughs> Sometimes we don't care about other people. When we do something, we do like so seriously. We don't talk about so much, right? But in the Philippines, it's totally different. The staff is so cheerful, like, oh, how are you? What's your name? Where are you from? Filipino people is very, very cheerful and so friendly. I was so surprised. Every time I go to Especially the Philippines, when they're I do like on oh, video. Hi, yeah. Have a great day. I feel like my personality is changed. <laughs> when you come back to Japan from the Philippines, friends and family will be surprised because your personality is more cheerful and friendly. Be careful. <laughs> also, my mom is very surprised because teach every us. time I go back to the farm, she says, Your yeah, personality is changed. I'm so cheerful, Pasa. <laughs> that mama, is the one mama. of the reasons you should not come to the Philippines. Number two, you cannot stand for the Japanese weather. In Japan, oh. we have four season spring summer mm -hmm. autumn winter mm -hmm. except summer japanese weather is so cold sometimes you can see mm -hmm. the snowing mm -hmm. when we go to outside we wear so many clothes especially winter but in the philippines it's so hot weather Girl, all year true. even christmas day too when I went to the Philippines on Christmas day, I had so many clothes from Japan, like heavy cut. <laughs> I did not use it because it's so hot. I sweat a lot. You should bring like t-shirts, no sleep, and you should bring towels too because you will be sweat so much. Every time I go back to <laughs> Japan, I feel like more cold. So I think it's little bit. I cannot stand for the Especially Japanese summer, weather. So be careful. Philippines. I really Girl. like summer season. When I in the Philippines, I feel summer season all day. Like I don't ice. like cold weather so much. So when I go but back to Japan, ice. I feel like I don't want to go back to Japan. One time you got the Philippines mm -hmm. weather, you cannot go back to Japan if you really like summer season. This is second reason you should not come to the Philippines. Summer! <laughs> Number three, you can get weight easily. She's so cute. In the Philippines, there are 
so many delicious food. We don't have Jollibees in Japan, oh. but you can find so many Jollibees in the Philippines. It's really cost so reasonable. It's so addictive. Also, we don't have night market except festival, right? Her Filipino food is, is sweeter than Japanese food. Japanese food is not so strong flavor, but the the Filipino food is a little bit stronger flavor for Japanese. So if you really like Filipino style and Western style, you can get weight easily. In the Philippines, there are so many kind of food, right? Filipino food, Western oh. food, Japanese, <laughs> Korean. Every time I go to the Philippines, I really enjoy eating. Yeah. I cannot stop eating. Food here it's is so amazing. Fun, but it's so dangerous. Be careful, Japanese Jolly. people. So many Japanese people really like mango, papaya, bananas, but uh, especially mango. It's expensive <laughs> food in Japan. In the Philippines, Just you can buy mango cheaper here. than Japan. Have you oh, watched my more. previous video which I went to popular the market. The that McDonald's. time I bought three mangoes. It cost so reasonable. That is sad reason. Yes, the you should not come to the Philippines. Sweet. Number four. You cannot go back to Japan. In Japan, everything is so expensive. When we go to restaurant for lunch, one meal you is over 1,000 yen. Even you go to McDonald's, it's just over 500 yen. But in the Philippines, if you have 500 yen, you can buy three meals at Jollibee. Jollibee is so reasonable really price. One meal is 100 peso, and the transportation is expensive. Lamp fee. Everything is expensive in Japan. Usually in Japan, I save money a lot. But in the Philippines. Everything is reasonable mm -hmm. price. That's why you cannot go back to Japan. Every time I go back to Japan, I feel like mm. it's so expensive. It's if so I pay expensive. This one, I can get 10 Jolly Bees menu. Have you watched my previous video which is 1,000 peso challenge at the night market and more? That was so hard to spend 1,000 peso because everything is reasonable. When I spend 1,000 peso at the night market, I bought so many food and I feel so satisfied. When I spend 1,000 peso at the mall, I bought so many Souvenir you can really enjoy within 1,000 peso. She I know it's expensive money, but uh, if you bought that amount of things, it costs double Try eating the sad prices in Japan. So, Number five, so, so that good. is last one. You have too much fun in the Philippines. You feel don't want to go back to mm -hmm. Japan because people yes. are nice, food are hello, nice, hello. weather is nice, everything is nice. Nice Everything so is hot. good for you. You feel like you don't wanna go back to Japan. I'm sure. Every time I go to the Philippines, I feel like I love Philippines more and more. First time mm. I went to Baguio for language school, I feel like it is so nice country and I got so much fun. And then I went to Manila, I feel like Manila nice too and the third time i wanna eat more philippine mm -hmm. food i wanna see more beautiful place in the philippines i got sweetheart from filipino <laughs> i'm foreigner in the philippines but the uh, filipino is so kind for me too so i feel like oh i wanna stay oh. here so it's so dangerous I think Japanese people love Philippines too. Be careful, it's so addictive country. Addictive I have never been to Cebu. There are more places I have never been to. So I think I will get more fun in the Philippines. I'm so scary! <laughs>
Japanese people really like rice. They love there are so many rice, rice menus. You can enjoy eating too. It's you not far away from rice. Japan to the Philippines. So you feel like I wanna go back to the Philippines again. That is five reasons. Mm -hmm. You should not come to the Philippines because it's so addictive <laughs> and you got so much fun in the Philippines. That's all! That is my five reasons Japanese you should not come to the Philippines. But uh, firstly, I would like to thank you so much to the Philippines and the Filipino because every time I go to the Philippines, you You're are welcome. so kind for me. Every time I upload the video, you say, I like this video and I really enjoy watching your Filipino video. Thank you so, so much. Every time I go to the Philippines, I had so much fun. That's why I love Philippines. I hope so many Japanese people come to the Philippines. But be careful. It's so nice place and uh, so much fun. I'm planning to go to the Philippines again. Okay. If you have any recommendation place or food, please let me know. Thank you so much always. If you like this video, please subscribe our channel and follow my Instagram. Manahare! See you on the next video. Bye bye. I enjoyed her video, and it's not really. She's not really, you know, talking bad about the Philippines. She's more appreciating everything that she experienced here in the Philippines. I enjoyed her video, and if you haven't watched her video. Please do watch and subscribe and share. And if you're enjoying this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe and comment down below or any suggestions that you want me to do. So take care. Have a great day. Bye.